What are the differences between mechanical and chemical digestion? Well, there are two major types of digestion, mechanical and chemical. And mechanical, first, can be thought of, of the churning, pushing, and pulling food apart down into smaller particles. So we'll make food small, but this has to do with not changing um, any chemical nature in the food. So think about your mouth while eating. Um, what organs would help you churn the food? As you can see in this picture, these teeth are incredibly useful for breaking down food. And also, you can imagine the churning nature of the stomach. The stomach actually is lined with incredible layers of muscle, smooth muscle tissue, which actually churn the food and break it down into smaller pieces. The next type of digestion takes place in the mouth, stomach, and small intestines. And this is chemical digestion. Chemical digestion involves chemical changes of food. So even before you start eating, your brain actually signals for the release of certain enzymes in the mouth. And this starts the process of chemical digestion. An enzyme known as sal salivary amylase will break down carbohydrates into um, simple sugars called monosaccharides. So that's the first step of chemical digestion in the mouth with carbohydrates. The second step in the stomach, enzymes called pepsin, for example, will break down proteins into smaller um, individual components, such as amino acids. But what about fats? Well, fats start to be broken down in the stomach uh, using a substance called bile. But it is finally broken down into its components, such as fatty acids, in the small intestine. Using pancreatic enzymes, um, the fats are finally broken down into, into smaller pieces in the small intestine. And for up to 40, or sorry, excuse me, 24 hours, the food will travel through the small intestine and digestive enzymes released will break down these foods. So things to remember. Mechanical digestion, as in the picture on the left, think M for movement, um, teething, teeth crushing food, and the pushing, pulling force. Um, but it's not a chemical change. And then chemical digestion using enzymes um, or even an acidic environment to break down foods. Um, carbs mainly in the mouth, proteins mainly in the stomach, and fats mainly in the small intestine. As a unit, mechanical and chemical digestion work to help us get the vital nutrients we need to survive.